Hello loves and welcome to Bree's Project Book. Today is a fab collab I have to share with you today. Our host, Kimberly, from A Blessed Home with Kimberly Davis. The title of the collaboration is Show Some Love. There is no rules for this collaboration. She just wants us to share our creativity in our space with you guys. Bubble baths are an affordable way to indulge for a romantic evening for two or for one. There is nothing like relaxing in a luxuriating pool of warmth scented froth. Okay, everyone, we are going to transition this space right here into a romantic evening for two for Valentine's Day. Here are some of my steps I use to create a beautiful bath for two. Of course, you can add your own ideas. This is just some of my ideas you can adopt if you wish. First, we need to clear the space. I like to start with a clean slate. An empty space gives my eye and creativity a new start with a blank canvas. After you clean your space, add the base materials or decorations to the space. These are the decorations that will start the foundation to your design, like wall art, apothecary jars, candles, candle holders, planters, bowls, platters, etc. Okay, everyone, we have put in our basic elements to start off our decor items. And these are the large, some of the large basic elements that I want to start off with. On this wall here, this wall is pretty large. And the artwork, you can see how big that is. So whatever I added in this bathroom around this tub had to be substantial in size. So you'll be able to see it because it would get lost in the space. And that bowl there is a perfect example. I wanted it to be large because it sits right up under that artwork. And I wanted to be able to be seen. Bathroom, the colors are in a spa-like. Your deep taupes and your light browns and beiges and some grays. Like river rocks kind of thing. That's the colors here that I wanted when I had the house built. And we wanted to play off those colors with something a little bit more darker and that's this black does a perfect job so those two lanterns flank the artwork plus they have great height so they play with the height here in the vertical space and that center bow plays with the width up under the artwork because of that long area there and that bow really covers it on each side of the surround platform on the left hand side we have a nice bow a pedestal bow, another one with a beautiful top, and that is a great, great accessories to put items in. And then on the other side of the surround, we have a black platter playing again with those black colors to bring uh, out that black in the artwork. Then down at the bottom, we have a beautiful area rug. So I love this rug. It's a five by seven. I purchased it from Overstock, I believe it was. It was either Overstock or Amazon. And it also brings in some softness here with all that tile on the floor. So a tip for you when you get ready to do your space. Of course, it might not be this size or it might be bigger. Make sure that you get accessories that matches the space that you'll be decorating. Make sure your decor is functional. You want it pretty, but you also want it functional. Now, most of the time in spas area, less is more. But since this is a more of a... A special occasion I wanted it to be a little bit more luxurious so I would be adding more texture in here and more items turns I also installed tassels of a taupe color on the lanterns to bring out some more taupe and then we have our beautiful and luxurious spa pillows these pillows are purchased from Amazon and they were $35, I believe it was, a piece. And they're very, very soft. They have four suctions at the bottom so they can adhere to the tub very firmly, very strong. And I love the rolled pillow at the top. It supports the neck, the head, and the shoulders. The pillows have a drying hook. On the side here that's inside there where you can 
hook it on the rod to dry. It also has um, laundry bags that you can put the pillows in to wash and they dry very quickly. So one of the essentials that you must have for a intimate spa or any spa are little river rocks, something that's natural and uh, greenery, things in that nature. So we're just going to use these little river rocks around the bath surrounds and some of the platters. Okay, everyone, here is the finished bathroom or romantic spa for two. So we'll start at the back wall. We have two large lanterns. This came from Kirkland's, just in case you were wondering. I had those for about a couple of years now, so they may still have them at Kirkland's if you're interested to check that out. Kirkland's have some beautiful uh, lanterns in all kinds of sizes. And then we come in the center and we have that beautiful oval bowl that we started out with and with the uh, mirrored riser and we filled it with spa accessories like your spa sponges and your scrubbers and all kinds of great things, headbands, things of that nature that you would need to have a nice spa. What I also done is added those gorgeous taupe tassels on the lanterns to bring in some more taupe. And I also put two very large battery operated candles in there. Then we get to the surround area of the tub. On the right hand side, we start with that beautiful glass hurricane candle holder and that three wick candle. And then next we have that black platter filled with those gorgeous river rocks. And on top of that, we have the Peck Sniffs Luxury Bath Lotion. It's from England. I uh, purchased that from TJ Maxx and it smells so, so, so good. The, the fragrance is citron and grapefruit. On the left hand side, we have the pedestal bowl. Um, it's black and crystal and inside that bowl we have black river rocks and on top of that we have the tea bags that I created. I love creating different tea bags. Aromatherapy, you have chamomile there, you have uh, lavender, you have um, mint. Then on the front of the bathtub we have two sets of towels. And those towels will not remain there, of course, when we have the bubble bath. But this is just a presentation of how it would look um, before we actually get into the spa. So what you see here is the actual spa, how I would set it up. Now I'm going to share with you what everything looks like when it's a spa romance for two for Valentine's Day. Okay, everyone. So this is what it looks like in the light and I will show you what it looks like when everything is the lights are turned down low we have the jacuzzi here with all the bubbles there you see there is um, mood lighting inside the jacuzzi I turned the jacuzzi off because it was making too much noise and um, those lights change from blue red pink yellow uh, to set the mood is a uh, aromatherapy tub we have the lights lit around. I think this looks very, very nice. Those beautiful four candles does the job. And then you see, I put the towels on the side there uh, to get them out the way of the water in the tub. And everything turned out very nice around that tub. You know, we have this gorgeous bench here that um, has a fur blanket on it. We have a beautiful fur rug that goes down to complement the area rug there and we have a mirror tray with some river stones and some luxurious body cream and here's where we will dry off and um, get ready for the second part of the evening and that is over here where we will give massages here on this nice bench the pillows will come off and then this towel here will lay out and then we give massages. Here we have a tray ready to be um, consumed with some chocolate strawberries and some grapes, two wine glasses. And we have the wine chilling over here in a bucket of ice and that is the massage oil there. And then we have some candles 
and we are ready for the evening guys I'm gonna give you a look around in while the lights are on and then I will turn the lights down and you will see what it looks like here are a few of my tips you want to keep in mind when creating your space give the space a relaxing atmosphere by incorporating natural elements such as rocks plants or greenery Colors play a primary role for a relaxing experience. Use soothing and natural colors. Stock plush tiles and upgrade your accessories to give that luxe detail, like aesthetically pleasing bath decor and products that blends well with your color theme. And lastly, soften your floors with rugs and mats, and don't forget your aromatherapy and music to set the mood and create that calm atmosphere. Hello oh, everyone, I hope you guys enjoyed this collaboration. I hope you guys had some ideas of how you can set up your jacuzzi spa for two for Valentine's Day or what have you. And um, don't forget to check out the ladies. I know they have a lot of ideas and creativity to share with you guys. You are not going to be disappointed. Thank you, Kimmy, for inviting me to this collaboration. I had so much fun setting this up and I will see you guys on the next video don't forget to check out the dream team they are going to wow you guys I just know it I'm going to sit back and check them out myself and then this evening we are going to enjoy this jacuzzi <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later see you soon love hugs and kisses Mwah. smooches